Total Action for Progress, also known as TAP. Total Action for Progress. Total Action for Progress. Total Action for Progress. Total Action for Progress. TAP. Children, family, ex-offenders, one group works with all of them. This is the umbrella organization for more than 30 different programs. And while it helps local people, it's piloted four different projects that have gone state and nationwide. It was in the late 80s when the national show CBS Sunday Morning featured a story on TAP. TAP, short for Total Action for Progress, runs the Head Start program. Their values include respect for others, advocacy for the oppressed, disadvantaged, and disenfranchised. Thousands of people have taken advantage of these Mission of Mercy clinics. Organizations like Total Action for Progress plan to establish more programs to meet the community's needs. One group is trying to paint the city of Roanoke purple. Total Action for Progress, also known as TAP, held an open house today to help raise awareness of domestic violence. The show is called To the New Girl from the former Mrs. Blank, and it's going on at Showtimers as a benefit fundraiser for TAP and Sabrina's Place. Instead of doing presents, I thought it would be nice to give donations. Evelyn's dance teacher is the program manager at Sabrina's Place, a supervised visitation and exchange program for families who have experienced domestic violence, child abuse, and other rough situations. After 25 years of service, TAP's Transitional Living Center in Roanoke will be closing its doors at the end of this month. But that will make way for a new system that will provide help for the homeless. TAP will now use a system that's more focused on getting the homeless in individual housing right away. Happening today, Youth Build will be teaming up with volunteers throughout the Roanoke Valley to build a home for a family in need. Run through Total Action for Progress. Youth Build helps young adults 16 to 24 get a construction cert certification while earning a GED. Well, Chris, the house you see behind me is being built by Total Action for Progress's Youth Build program. Now, more than 30 students were out here today picking up a hammer and getting to work. That's because today is National Youth Build Day. The program is called Virginia Cares. It allows inmates to get back on their feet with some schooling. The ultimate goal is to find them full time employment once released. I'm outside of the Virginia Cares building where 11 district delegate Sam Rasul stopped by to talk about the Ban the Box initiative. Ban the Box is also giving a person the opportunity to say, okay, I messed up in the past, but I'm a good prospect to work, into your, work in your company. A group from Virginia Cares, which operates under total action for progress, went before city council asking it to consider banning the box. The single deterrent to going back to jail is having a job. And so we want people to have an access to turn their lives around. Through the Virginia Cares program, Walters is set to start college this summer. It's all about Dad. It's a free event that promises to be a great time. Nick Klein from Total Action for Progress joins us now with more. And in Roanoke, fathers and caretakers were the stars of the show this afternoon at Preston Park. TAP, short for the Total Action for Progress, and other local agencies held their first Father's Day Fest. New music video is helping spread the word about one Roanoke program. Here's a look at the new rap video about Fathers First. It talks about mentoring services and other programs aimed toward, aimed toward helping men become better fathers. Dozens of people showed up at the Science Museum for the premiere. Now, this is the third year of the Fathers First program. Organizers say it's grown over the years and they hope this video helps raise awareness about the services they provide. Wormley is now the poster child for the program and is reaching out to other fathers through his love of music. Where opportunities, learn great job skills they want to see. Wormley, also known as Fat Rob, hopes this music video will push others to make changes in their lives so their children can live better lives.